Cole's night in. Yes, we're handing over RTV to Mrs. Cole and kicking off this big X Factor weekend in style. And talking of the X Factor, you've got a bit of pressure on you tonight. Massive pressure. Massive pressure. Although I do feel like I've got the best one. How did it all come about in the first place? Actually, we're supposed to do Britain's Got Talent. Really? Yes. Um, so I had a few phone calls and stuff about Britain's Got Talent on the verge of doing it. So that would have been instead uh, of Amanda? Yeah. <laughs> Although I do love Amanda, I think she's amazing on there. Of and course. I think X Factor seems like it was just the right thing for me at the right time now. It feels like it was just it was meant to be. You let us sneak backstage, did. you, didn't you, last week? Yeah. Well, let's see how much really does go on when we followed you behind the scenes on last week's X Factor. We love X Factor! I think she's a very good judge. Well, she's really feisty as a judge. I don't know where she is. And that's why she's placed next to Simon. She's, she can biff him. Cheryl? No? no? Cheryl's not here. So this is what I get up to behind the scenes at X Factor. What well, ironic song choice. He's singing She's Out of My Life. No, Cheryl. So I've stepped in. So this is my dressing room. As you can see, it's quite small. Her dressing room is pretty untidy. That's Simon. I'm scared what he's going to say. No answer. This is where I get my hair and makeup done for about two hours. This is what I'll wear tonight. And then we go through the process of gorgeous shoes. It's got a mentor and artist, yeah. pretty confident. Yeah. yeah. Both yeah. songs are great, OK? Anything else? <laughs> and Cheryl? <laughs> Joe, she's back. Uh, hello, Mr. Walsh. How are you? <laughs> Come to my dressing room. Cheryl always looks so nice and she's so well dressed and clean and tiny and everything. <laughs> But she eats all this junk food. Cheryl eats all the sugar. I get absolutely spoiled at the X Factor. She has all these people out getting her food all the time. Someone knocks on the door every five minutes to see if I need anything. Eating crisps, eating junk food. I don't know how she does it, but she's... Sweets, chocolate, sweets, chocolate. I've got lollipop, sugar boost. She eats so much for somebody so little. And I always have the pudding, whatever's on the menu. I don't know where she puts it. I think she's a really good judge. I think she identifies with the people at home because she came through this whole process with pop stars arrival. No, a bit of advice, pretend that you care, OK? We're all on the same floor, but um, God is upstairs. I think the three of us should get for him to a chair and cut the and hair. Cut the hair. <laughs> Mr. Cow, it's over. <laughs> It's not that hard work at all. Yeah, maybe that was a little bit misleading. <laughs> <laughs> um, Simon Cowell. Yes. Love him, hate him? Love him. <laughs> <laughs> really? Yeah, no, he's a great guy. And I feel like I'm learning a lot from Simon, but he can be really, really annoying. Do you think he might fancy you a little bit? No. <laughs> no! <laughs> They say yes. No. The voice of the nation speaks and they say yes. Well, yeah. <laughs> well then he's really not going the right way about it. <laughs> <laughs> he called me up one week. He watched a show. And you know when we do that talking but before? Yeah. And um, we talk about our acts and stuff and he went to me, I'm just ringing you because I don't know what you were wearing on your VT. <laughs> you looked terrible and your personality was like a snail. <laughs> so I get it as well. Believe you me, it's not just the contestants. So he's judging you? Yeah, he, he's, and he's rude to me. And, and not only just judging you, about fashion. Hello. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. OK, um, Alexandra. Yes. Um, when she first walked into that room, did you know then that she could be the winner? I remember watching it back, having the goosebumps at the time and thinking, this girl's incredible. But I wouldn't have said there and then, this girl could win it. It's amazing. I feel like we've all watched her as a nation just grow and grow and grow mm. into a 